UCO Student Programming Board hosted their 10th anniversary of their drag show, Glamazon. U Central's Kelly Clayton has this report. Well, it couldn't officially be iHeart Central Week without the thrilling celebration, Glamazon. This dazzling experience certainly had reason to celebrate. And this year is extra special because it is our 10th anniversary. We have 10 local queens to represent the 10 years that Glamazon has been alive. With a DJ and catwalk all revved up and ready to roll, this year's ensemble of drag artists threatened everyone with a good time. Each and every one of them is unique and brings something different to the table. We are so lucky to have such a diverse cast of performers, and they are going to be putting on an incredible show. Mocktail refreshments were on hand to keep all spirits reasonable. We have drinks named after all things drag related and UCO related. And near the concessions table were tip jars for each performer, encouraging spectators to show appreciation for their talents. While UCO embraces diversity and progressive activities on campus such as Glamazon, recent legislation, most specifically House Bill 2186, has threatened to rain on the parade and censor the exposure of all drag events in the state in a public setting, so safety was key. In order to avoid legal complications, no cameras or recording devices were allowed into the show and IDs were all checked verifying all attendees over 18. And though lawmakers can sometimes be a drag, the show must go on, and to the delight of many. And there is a, a community here that wants this representation and wants to be seen and heard. And it is so special to me to be a part of cultivating this experience. For you, Central News, I'm Kelly Clayton.